Hi, I'm Dr. Tony. And I'm pharmacist Karan. And welcome to another edition of Can, Can We, we Talk? Talk? Tony, so many people are starting to appreciate the benefits of using a continuous glucose monitor, also known as a CGM. Unfortunately, many don't ever get access to this great technology. This can be frustrating to the patient, me, their pharmacist, and you as their doctor. That's right, Karan. And with so many of my patients wanting to enjoy the benefits of using a CGM, but unable to get one because it's often not covered by insurance, I decided to do some research to determine which direct to consumer CGM company was the most affordable for my patients. That's when I discovered Thea Health. I have since developed an affiliate relationship with them so that my patients have an option that is affordable when they want to take advantage of the CGM technology. I'll share my affiliate link in the video notes. And if you are a doctor or other clinician and are frustrated because your patients can't afford a CGM, I'll share an additional link in the video notes, which will allow you to give your patients access to this affordable option. Now that we know that there is an affordable way to get a CGM to the many people who desire one, let's explain why we think 93% of Americans should consider using a CGM as a way to achieve metabolic health. I'll start by reminding everyone that the recent study by Tufts University shocked many when they revealed that only around 7% of Americans are metabolically healthy. And since many so-called chronic health conditions are related to poor metabolic health, we just need tools to help us monitor our metabolic health so we can prevent many of these medical conditions. Examples of some medical conditions related to poor metabolic health include heart disease, poor cholesterol, hypertension, type 2 diabetes, dementia, cancer, and many more. As a reminder, Quran, poor metabolic health is when three out of five factors are not at go and include our blood pressure, blood sugar, waist size, HDL or good cholesterol, and triglycerides. The key is to understand that the biggest cause of poor metabolic health is hyperinsulinemia, primarily caused by high glucose level spikes. It's sometimes hard to understand why other medical conditions other than diabetes is related to poor metabolic health. So, so let's take a look at an image I've shared in other videos related to hypertension. As you can see, overnutrition with foods that raise your blood glucose like grains, sugars, and starches results in hyperinsulinemia, in addition to calcium influx leading to vasoconstriction of our arteries, sodium or salt reabsorption, damage to our blood vessel lining, the influx of macrophages leading to inflammation and, and culminating in hypertension, not to mention the insulin resistance that leads to a decrease in endothelial nitric oxide, leading to even more basal constriction and hypertension. Now imagine having a tool that can measure when and why these spikes are occurring by measuring our blood glucose values continuously. Having this type of data at our fingertips would be critical for customers to patients who are trying to reverse or prevent poor metabolic health. Let's share some of the reasons why we both love making sure everyone can have access to a CGM. First of all, it's a great tool to monitor for glycemic variability. Glycemic variability refers to fluctuations in blood glucose levels and when the variability is high, the risk for hypoglycemia, microvascular and macrovascular complications, and overall mortality will be higher. You know, and this, inf this information is more helpful than just having a hemoglobin A1C since a person with an A1C of seven, which is a blood glucose of 150, could have blood glucose levels with low variability with levels between 140 and 160, or high variability with levels between 100 and 200. Although the A1C values are the same, the person with high variability with higher spikes are more likely to have complications related to those spikes. The goal is to have a narrow range of glucose values. And what's also cool about CGMs is that it is a great tool for giving my customers immediate feedback 
when that glycemic variability is occurring, providing clarity as to how our blood glucose is impacted by various factors. Those factors include what we are eating, our stress levels, the impact of exercise, or even how much sleep we are getting. With that feedback, they can make as needed adjustments so that they can avoid glycemic variability. But the biggest benefit may be that having a CGM impacts our decisions. Just having our blood glucose uh, being monitored is crucial. My patients tell me that it's like having me with them 24 hours a day, helping them psychologically by get, guiding them to making better decisions. This leads to better decision-making in the moment. So in some ways, a CGM can serve as our coach and accountability partner. You are so right. And most of us will face struggles as we work on our metabolic health. And at times we need that extra little nudge in the world because it is filled with so many temptations. So hopefully this video has helped you better understand why the metabolic health couple are fans of continuous glucose monitors and why so many people should consider one as a tool to help them achieve metabolic health. We hope these tips have helped you. And if so, like, subscribe, and share this video with your friends and family. And don't forget to check out the links for a more affordable CGM option. So until the next video from the Metabolic Health Couple, stay, stay safe, safe and healthy. healthy.